Mr. A, but I thought there's something that you ought to know. Uh, Kong got the pictures of Leon Monroe's girlfriend, Roxy, and they're being developed right now. Mike went over with them to make sure that they were the right girl, and they'll be here in a little bit. Well, thank you for informing me, Jazz, but uh, Michael just phoned me about that. Oh, well, that's it. I'm out of here. Uh, Jazz, sit down. The boss wants to talk to you about something. Michael tells me that you've been getting a little bit restless lately, Mr. Jackson. <laughs> restless? Yeah. We'll surely recall a conversation you had at Sleazy's. Oh, come on, that didn't mean nothing. That's just bar talk. Well, Michael seemed to feel that you were definitely unhappy. It wasn't nothing. All right, I just ran off at the lip a little bit, okay? Well, please, would you talk to me, too? You know, what bothers you bothers the family. I'd like to help if I can. Help? Yes, perhaps you'd like to take a little vacation. Join your brother. Well, maybe you want to leave us permanently. <laughs> I wasn't serious about any of that, okay? <laughs> now listen to me, Jazz. I know how important family ties are. Well, haven't I been telling you that for years? Yeah, but you've been talking about this family. Now, I'm also talking about flesh and blood family. You were? But I don't want to allow you to leave us until I find out what it is you want or what you need. Look, are you saying that you'll let me go? Well, I'm sure that some sort of an arrangement can be made, yes. Mr. A, it's not that I don't appreciate what you've done for me and my brother, all right? The bread you used to uh, put into school and everything, <laughs> Listen, but I... You don't have to explain to me, Jazz. See, I also have a brother. I have two of them, as a matter of fact, and... I know what it feels like to be separated from one's own siblings. Look, yeah, he's the uh, only brother, only family I got in this world mean a lot to me, and I'd do just about anything, almost anything. Well, trust me, I'm certainly not going to take advantage of a man's desire to be next to his only living relative. This would mean more to me than, than I could tell you. I mean, to be with my brother, be a dream come true. You really mean it, Mr. A? You'd let me go to New York to live with my brother? <laughs> I'm certainly going to give it some very serious thought. Oh, in the meanwhile, suppose you think about when it is you want to leave us. Well, I can answer that now, as soon as possible. <laughs> that kid brother means a lot to you, doesn't he? Yeah. Everything. Everything. <laughs> well, then, uh, let's see what we can do about having the two of you together permanently. Thank you, boss. I'll get back to you on this in a couple of days, okay? I'll be waiting. Thanks again.